up guys, Heking here, bringing you another live reaction to this week's Marvel's The Falcon and the Winter Soldier Episode 5. I didn't do a reaction last week, uh, which I had now, but yeah, this one's supposed to be important, it's an hour long, it's supposed to be a special cameo, I'm not gonna get hyped for it because we all got hyped last time for WandaVision and it was disappointing, so none of that this time, but yeah, let's see how this episode's gonna be. Um, might include the footage, might not. No audio, I'm listening with my headphones. There's no subtitles on this one, so it sucks. But yeah, uh, just follow along, guys. When I press the button, and when I say we go, we go. And it'll be continuous. So, yeah. Start in... Oh, 57 minutes and 23 seconds long. Okay, start in now. Starting will be left off. Yeah. Previously on. Sorry, I just woke up and haven't had breakfast, so. Why would they visit the memorial? They didn't have anything to do with Sokovia. They should have put body armor, like proper good strong body armor there instead of... Oh god, this is brutal. This dude was a fan of Captain America and he, get, he gets killed by... He gets killed by Captain America's shield. My son. Jesus, man. Is he running away, the pussy? He just killed. Is it? Is it covered in blood? No. Yeah. Oh, he's having PTSD from doing that. Jesus. Yeah, it's still covered in blood. Jesus. Oh, they're gonna take the shield from him here. They've been building up the scene in the in the in the in the trailers that came out. They're gonna have to kick his ass and take the shield. I'm sorry. You just you just crossed the line there. You just did something Captain America wouldn't do. You you idiot. You didn't make the right decision there. He just completely destroyed the image of himself as Captain America, like... There's a Dark Knight element to the soundtrack here. Watch the world burn. Watch the world burn. That's what it sounds like. Two faces theme from the a little bit. No.
It's similar. Jesus, it's like a... Yeah. We choose violence. Oh my god. Here we go. Super soldier against super soldier. Here we go. Oh. Trying to get rid of his guns. Jesus. He was going to kill him. And that, that arm is made from vibranium. So it should withstand it. Oh my god. You've got the shield off before, Bucky. Come on. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, Bucky's got the shield. Keep it. Keep the shield. Sam, you gotta, like, you gotta fly in there and kick his ass. He's a... Because you're a psycho. Oh, the arm's going. The arm's going. What's wrong with this dude? He's going for the kill. I mean, he's not wrong. He did try. He did go to them first about... Oh, my God. This action's amazing. Like, we just see so many different... Look at that. Look at that. Oh, oh, he's going, oh. Oh, he's not letting him go. Bucky, get up. Get up. No, you're not. Oh, he ripped the wings off. Jesus. Like, Bucky's the only one I can really go toe-to-toe -to -toe with him because of the... Break his arm. Yeah, we go. Beat the shit out of him and knock him out. Tag team that bitch. There we go. What a prick. Look, he's got the shield. He's carrying the shield. Like, yeah. Oh, no. Is he giving it, he's giving it to Sam. He's like, you want it? Here you go. Man, Sam, like, wow. Bucky's, like, respect for the shield has gone away, man. Like, damn. Oh, God. Seeing it covered in blood, man. Like, that's just so wrong. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Yeah, my heart. Oh, just trying to wipe it clean. That's depressing, man. I get, I get where he's coming. Like, <sighs> what the hell are they?
Yeah. 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 You go ripped off. Oh, I thought they were referring to the wigs that like they can't fix it. Like what? Obviously, obviously they can. Sam, Sam should meet Cherry and get vibranium blades like wings. I like this dude, Taurus, yeah. Yeah, because I think I think he's Falcom in the comics, I think, this character. I'm not I'm not sure. Well that's funny, like keep the wings. I've got the shield now, like gonna have a What's this? What's this bitch gonna say to like get out of this? Yeah, good, dumbass prick. Nice no, girlfriend. He's a psycho. That's the problem. You're a good... That's not what Captain America is. He's supposed to be a good person, not a good soldier. No, you're not. Fuck off. Nope, you didn't know what it takes to be Captain America. I know I'm hating on him. I get, I get, I get his reasons, but the dude. Is this the cameo? It's his mom, I'm assuming. Because everyone was like, it's, 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 it's going to be the character's mother. But who's playing her? Who's that? Who's that? I don't know who this is. Val? Okay, it's not. This is the power breaker a bit.
This is the power broker. Oh, that's his wife. Is this who they were hyping up the whole time? I don't recognize the actress, I don't recognize the character, I'm assuming it's the power broker. There's a trick behind it, like Mary Cold, or... I wanna see Zemo again, man, that's all, that's all I wanna see, I wanna see my boy Zemo! Why, look at this, oh, we're gonna see Kyle, yeah. You just lost you just lost one of your your friends by convincing him to do all this crap like like he was a fan of Captain America you made him do all this shit and they just they just deported they just took and deported everyone huh or yeah look what your actions did dumb cunt well done look what your actions have I don't like this ca- What movement? What- What's their end game here? Like, I'm curious, like, what- what they're gonna try and do, like- The memorial, here we go, Sokovia. Zemo! Sad, man. Sokovia. There we go. <laughs> you gave him a little clue, previously. He's not wrong, but at the, at the same time, like, I'm looking at both viewpoints here, but I'm kind of on Zemo's side. Like, after she killed those people, it's like, no. He wants to die, though, like, he, he tried to commit suicide, so for him, it's like, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, he's not going to kill him. Oh, they're going to take him, damn. Is his story over then?
I liked it. Is that it? Like, I'm a bit disappointed that's how it ends, but... Oh. Oh. The... The... The raft where all the villains are properly locked up. Prison escape. What's that? Make make vibranium wings for my boy Sam. Is he gonna go see Isaacs? Oh. And he becomes Patriot, right, in the Young Avengers. Imagine if his granddad imagine if his granddad is the power broker. Like that that would be that would be a crazy twist. Because a lot of people have been like, what if what if he's the power broker? Like what if he's the one doing all of this to get revenge or Is it gonna go to him and be like, here's the shield, I'm giving it to you? Okay. What does that mean, right? Yeah. Sadly. Yeah. If he had known, he would have broken him out. His wife? That's what the hell's wrong with... Okay. Oh, the side effects? What? So he goes in, saves him. So he all died. Oh my. God, is that what is that a brand? What the hell? Did they they cut him up? What? Huh. 
because he was he was a good person. I don't know, this is actually making me... His granddaughter, did he say? Or his daughter? That really hurts, man. Fixing the boat. Why? <laughs> That's funny. Well, she told her. Keeps keep saying that. Keep saying that. Okay. Yes. Gonna save up the money and fix the boat. Remember 
imagine he fixes the bow and it get it gets destroyed. Was that Will Smith? I'm sorry, it sounded like Will Smith, like... Oh, he's bringing him to... He's bringing him to help fix it, not... not... How about you fix this boat first and then I'll consider put opening that case and putting whatever is in there on. Bonding, man. Yeah, go on. Oh, God. Is he just going to do that to annoy him? Like... <laughs> What is Bucky doing? Just okay. There you go. Nice and easy. <laughs> no, she's not going to throw it. Yeah. Is that is that Heineken? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Feed you to the. Oh, that's funny, man. Yeah, that's a that's a no go, man. You can stay at my house, but you cannot flirt with my sis. <laughs> Liar. What a lying piece of shit.
you can sort of see, you can sort of kind of see the comparisons of what they're sort of doing. Like you kind of look at it, and you're like thinking maybe look maybe Lamar should have been Captain America in a way. Do you know what I mean like the way that Sam should be Captain America? Like a good person. That's the whole key thing. Like that's what Doctor Eskin said. Like you know like. You're a lying piece of shit. <laughs> now he's gonna go after Carly because he wants to get revenge on her, like. Cap his bag. What a prick. You ruined your entire reputation like that. It's that boat truck. It's boat truck. She's the power broker, isn't she? She's the power. She's hiring boat, boat truck the leaper. Jesus, man. Because he's Algerian. Like, Al or is he French? Algerian French? You want to destroy the shield, but for others it is a symbol of awesomeness and hope. Tough love. I'd like to live in a place like this. Looks, looks, oh. Okay, stop talking like that, Sam, and just practice.
So is he dead then? Hmm. Uh, Sam, news and he, news and he's cancelling it by Scoodle. Yeah. Is this? It's not gonna make you feel. Yeah. <laughs> Get them, the bros, the bros. No, <laughs> they're not that good. Yeah. I love this uh, romance between them. It's great. And Sam's finally becoming his own person as well. Do you know what I mean throughout this series? Like, it's great. Oh, they're gonna... You're not in your shoes. Yeah. 
Yo, flop. Got to buckle up a bit more, get a bit more muscle. If he's not careful, he might end up slicing his hand or arm, or leg off, like Christ. Okay. Did he say on your left? If it fell in the water, I'm gonna jump off and get it. Back with these fools, ya fools. From who? What? What? Sharon is what? I have what you want. What? I don't get it. They're working for Sharon. What? Kill who? Imagine if the power broker is the guy they 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 they, they try to kidnap at the very beginning of the of the first of the first episode, like or, or something. I don't know, like. So Sharon is because Sharon called him. That's crazy, man. Like, so New York. Yeah. Oh, we're going to see the... Oh my god, they got people everywhere, Jesus. So Sharon can't be the power broker though, she's but she's helping them. Here we go. Go on man. I love that they had his ID and fingerprint whatever like at the ready light.
Okay, I heard there's an end credit scene, so... That was such a good episode. Current development. Just... Oh, God. That first action sequence, like, that, first, that fight scene at the beginning was great. What more can I say, man? Like the political aspects of the show are so done well. Like, like you can't, you kind of, you, you kind of get a good idea now why they they had Sam take the shield at the end of Endgame so they could lead into this, and it's like such a good storytelling that they're doing. Like, like I wasn't up for it. Like when when Sam got the shield at the end of Endgame, I was disappointed. I was like, it should be Bucky, but when you watch the film. You kind of get the idea of why Steve chose Sam. Because, you know, he's not a good soldier. He's a good person. And then, of course, you look at this now and it's like, yeah, it makes sense. Like, it was the right decision for Sam to get the shield. Can I just say that the music is, is great. Like, they, I, I love they brought Henry Jackson back to do the soundtrack for this. Like, like just hearing all those familiar themes. And seeing Sam's evolution of the Falcon theme is great to hear. So who is the power broker then? It's weird that Anthony Mackie isn't the first name that pops up. Instead it's uh, Sebastian Stan and then... Zemo has to get like a cameo or something at the end of the series. Well they can't just end it, end it with that. There we go. Oh god. What's he doing? Is he making his own shield? Yeah, Jesus. That thing's gonna snap like a twig, man. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Wow, man, that was a good episode. So full of emotion and that. I, lo I loved it. I liked it a lot. I can't wait to see the final. I just hope it lives up. I hope it just it closes it off in a good way, like, compared to One Division, which was just disappointing um all that hype since last week like oh my god it was the big cameo gonna be and it was just some random woman yeah okay i'm not disappointed here but like i am disappointed in the fact that i didn't recognize the actress like i, I didn't know i didn't know who that was um I, I, I was expecting to recognize them but i didn't so that was that was really that was really disappointing. Actually, let me see if I can go in the credits and, and see if I can get the name. Um, okay, let's see if I can find... What was the name? Zev or something? Um, uh, I, I don't think... Was it Nico? I don't, I don't even remember what the character's name was. Right, it was Valentina. Okay, Julia Lewis Dufre. That's that's the character. That's the that was the actress, right? Uh, I don't know who that is. Again, a more needless hype. Basically, it's like, oh my god, it's the actress. You 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 recognize her? Like who? Like like no seriously, like who? Uh, let's see, French actress. Uh, film photography. No, not really. No, don't don't recognize her at all. No. Yeah, that was that was that was needless, pointless hype. I, I was expecting, 
I don't know why. I was expecting like some big unexpected uh, actress to cameo in this. Like, um, okay, whatever. I'm just hoping next episode's great. Um, I'm hoping Zemo's story isn't done. I'm hoping the end credit for the next for the for the last episode is is General Ross just coming into the raft, or maybe we get like a. Uh, some sort of shot and we see a lot of the prisoners in the raft and we see some recognizable faces like Justin Hammer maybe but he's at Seagate isn't he uh, uh, maybe me maybe email Blotsky to sort of set up a uh, abomination for the She-Hulk uh, show there's so much potential do you know what I mean like but uh, yeah that's crazy man like uh, I, I assume the Wakandians were going to come and take Zemo and take him to Wakanda but no they're taking him to the <laughs> raft it's like why wasn't he locked up in the raft to begin with do you know what I mean but uh, uh but yeah, uh, General Ross is in charge of the raft. So yeah, that that's probably that is leading into a meeting with them. Yeah, like uh, yeah, I, I, I didn't even think about that. I didn't cock that. I just I just realized. Yeah, wait a second. The raft is, is is controlled by General Ross. So technically speaking, he's gonna meet Zemo, and he's probably gonna make a deal with him, and it's gonna lead into Thunderbolts. So yeah, uh, awesome. I can't wait to see that. I'm hoping I'm right for that. But yeah, man, good episode. Loved it. I hope you guys liked my reaction to that. Um, as always, guys, like and subscribe, whatever. And I shall see you when I shall see you. Take care and bye.